afternoon guys it is thursday um a little bit of a late start vlogging today it's just gone one o'clock um good news my spot <laughs> it didn't seem to get any bigger <laughs> overnight so um yeah that's a good thing i guess uh so what am i doing all morning i've just been on my computer working um i am getting a little bit hungry so I was thinking of actually going for a walk and getting getting something takeaway. Beautiful breeze. You guys probably can't hear me though because of the wind. up going to Suki which is like a they do pocky pokey or pocky bowls however you say it and burritos um so I got a pock <laughs> I don't know how you say it pokey a pokey bowl <laughs> um and inside is spinach caps no not capsicum spinach cabbage corn cucumber carrot chicken um, macadamia nuts and coconut and then a sesame oil dressing oh and broccoli and I'm also having some water as well I washed my hair this morning um, and it was still quite damp when I went out to get some lunch and then by the time I got back it was just like fully dry <laughs> from the wind and the and the sun so that was very convenient <laughs> Oof, you've gone very dark um, yeah I'm not really feeling very I don't know I'm not really feeling very chatty today <laughs> I've just tried to get stuck in. Why have I got cat hair all over me? <laughs> I'm just getting stuck into doing my Kickstarter. Yeah, that's it really. I'm just defrosting some frozen raspberries and blueberries. I'm just really feeling like some fruit, so I'm listening to my body. <laughs> Jam and stew. I came here for you. That's it. 
the way I feel about you. I've never felt it to anybody else. I just want to live life with you. In my head, you're everything I've been looking for. Absolutely everything. In my head, I know you're everything. But my heart belongs to someone else. Good morning guys, it is Friday, I'm just <laughs> trying to get my bag, um, I'm just heading out to the post office. Yeah, I'm just heading out to the post office. So I thought I'd bring you guys along. Um, yesterday's vlog was super short. So I thought I would just merge yesterday's and today's vlog into one vlog. Because um, there's no point in posting like a two minute vlog, I guess. I've got my new <laughs> $9 Kmart top on. Or was it $5? I can't remember now. <laughs> And I'm so excited, I ordered myself some new sunglasses last night. Um, so I think it said they'll come on Monday. But I bought these ones um, in Hawaii when we got married. So they're about seven, six or seven years old. So I'm kind of due for some new um, sunnies. I'm home. <laughs> Oh, I'm a little bit warm. It's beautiful outside though. There's a lovely nice breeze. I couldn't really film much when I was walking because the, the wind kept picking up and it just distorts all of the volume on here. So, Did you guys watch the finale of The Bachelorette last night? <laughs> I'm so happy that she picked Stu. He seems like a nice guy. But I do feel really sorry for Jared. Like I think I think he was a bit obsessed with her though, like, like in a bit of a creepy way, I don't know. But I'm kind of sad it's all over, I love watching Sophie Monk, I think she's so funny, like she's just a really, she seems like a nice down to earth type of person, so, yeah. How good does this look? <laughs> I've just made myself an iced coffee, so I just put in um, a shot of coffee cold water, a tiny bit of milk, ice cubes, stevia, and then I put some whipped cream on top with a little bit of um, hot chocolate powder. <laughs> Ice coffees just go hand in hand with, with hot days, I think. <laughs> so good. I think we're all a little bit hot today, aren't we? Hey, hot Monty. Oh, he's so cute. And Mitzi's hiding under here. <laughs> you can't really even see her. <laughs> I thought I would make myself a nice coffee uh, just to perk myself up a little bit. I find when I'm on my lap laptop for a long time, like I start to feel my eyes start getting, start to get heavy. Um, so yeah, I thought I would just take a little break, have a coffee, and have a little chat to you guys. Uh, so I'm feeling better than I felt yesterday. Yesterday I, I just felt a little bit, a little bit off. Um, and I'm still finding eating the keto way a little bit hard. Um, I think what I'm struggling with is 
all of the fat like I feel like I can do low carb very easily I don't mind eating low carb at all but with keto you from what I know you have to have a lot of fat in in your diet and that's what I'm struggling with I'm finding with all of my meals like I'm finding I have to add a lot of cheese and a lot of butter a lot of cream and I'm just not used to that and I, I can't get my head around it and um, yeah I just I just feel really heavy like health wise I've had no health issues but I just I don't feel me like I don't feel like it's hard to explain I don't feel lightened like I have no idea how to explain it <laughs> I think the best way is just to say that I just feel quite heavy um, yeah it's a really weird feeling so on Sunday it'll be three weeks since I started uh, the keto diet I guess you could say and I think I might just end it there I mean there's no point in me doing another week if I if I'm not enjoying it and if I don't feel good on it is there um, so yeah I don't know Why is weight loss so hard? <laughs> I guess if it was easy, everybody would be slim, wouldn't we? been for a little walk <laughs> it's funny every time I walk into the bathroom I always have to like do a double check to make sure there's no huge spiders in here it's kind of scarred me for life that big huge huntsman being in here a while ago <laughs> um, I'm just enjoying one of these sparkling waters these are so good and refreshing um, the Mount Franklin lightly sparking, sparkling with a hint of lime. So good. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to take, cleanse my face and um, yeah, I think, I don't know, what, what do we do? I think we're going to watch um, like one of those renovation shows on TV and just chill out, I think. It's a pretty epic Friday night in the James household. <laughs> but I am officially counting down. Actually, I've been counting down for a while now. But it's uh, exactly seven days and then I'll see my mum, dad and brother and I can't wait. I'm just trying to figure out where we can take them. Um, I think we might go to Montville because um, it's pretty up there. My mum, I think she'll like all of the shops up there. <laughs> And we might go to Noosa. I would like to go to Byron Bay, but I think Jay and I might just do that like as a little getaway next year. Um, but yeah, I'm getting so excited. <laughs> okay, I am going to end the vlog here for tonight. So I hope you've all enjoyed yesterday's and today's vlog. And I'll see you guys all again tomorrow.